Hi, welcome to everybody in the final test video about the N-Scale Wi-Fi controlled model train. Okay. My name is Thomas. I came from Hungary. Uh, you should know that some people have asked me to do uh, English speaking video instead of Hungarian due to the language was unfamiliar <laughs> for them. Uh, this was acceptable, however, the similar videos have been already uploaded earlier. Okay, just for the beginning. Okay, let's have a look the entire system, how does it work. Uh, first of all, you should know these locos have equipped with popular ESP8266 module. I try to show you this module. Uh, I hope uh, you see that. Ah, okay. You can see this is very, very small, very small module, really small. Okay, it's needed because uh, the model uh, train is. Uh, very small scale is N scale N Pro 160. It means that uh, it's a uh, big talking about the very small devices. Yes, uh, first of all, we can try to start the application. Yes, the application should be ready. And I try to restart. Okay, the application is, seems to be okay now. Some uh, information before uh, we, uh, we start. As you probably know, this N scale model size is uh, quite small. Uh, I mentioned before. Uh, for you can uh, take a comparison between the real size and the model size. Take a look, a real size of track cross section for feel the difference of the sizes. I will try to show. Ah. This is the real, real size of the track. Okay. Okay, back to the electronic of the system. All locos have equipped with a Wi Fi control module, which name is a ESP8266. As you can see before, and like uh, it's uh, therefore each uh, locos contains own web server and has unique IP address also. I I will show you the practice. I will try to select one of them, the blue one, maybe this, and uh, we now start try to start. Yes, uh, you can see the very small, slow moving. We can increase the speed of it. Okay, and sure, it ran some test rounds. We can adjust the speed via slider. You can see that the speed up. Yes, it 
it reached the actual speed uh, level it uh, currently is 5 ok let's uh, make a direction change now oh it's perfect direction was changed and train uh, has reached the previously set speed again okay keep it running and uh, try to access the other one its name is track tax sorry and try to start it okay very slowly also increase the speed of it okay I try to additional speed up oh, once more okay And now try the direction change the red one. As you can see, all locals can be controlled by the mobile phone or tablet via Wi Fi connection. In current cases, uh, their speed can be adjusted mostly and up and down from the mobile apps. It's also possible to change running direction as well. Okay, some word uh, about the mobile app. The mobile app uh, communicates with uh, them via HTTP protocol tunnel with uh, GET commands. Okay, just uh, try to uh, stop one of them. The red one is stopped and start again. I'm just playing. Increase the speed again. Okay, the mobile apps uh, are also made by me. I used for development for Adobe Air framework. The reason was that it has several benefits against the native Android developing environments. For example, Android Studio. Adobe Air developing much more easier for the beginner. Further advantages is that application suitable for both iOS and Android phones as well. Wish to say some words about the technical details, about the tracks on the voltages. 
system uh, probably can be operated beside existing traditional digital control like the DCC or Locopilot because it is independent from the track communication because so all, all communication via, uh, flow via radio communication, Wi-Fi connection use and uh, it's a totally independent of the other system Okay, some uh, additional info about the power supply that the track voltage is normally a 12 volt DC You can see the power, power consumption, current consumption on the voltmeter it's currently um, 460 uh, milliamps. It's quite quite uh, high because the power consumption, the Wi-Fi module is is a uh, little bit high. Okay, guys, try to stop them. First stop the tracks now, okay? Select other one. This uh, this one is the blue one. Okay, uh, I didn't mention that uh, there is a possibility to check database and the database consistency between the tablet and um, and the locos. Use for that in the tick sign in the last row. Yes, I tried to push it. Okay, it's, you can you can see that the the screen actualized with the current data. Okay, try try to make finally a direction change. Yes, now. Okay, and try finally a normal stop. Okay, that's it. Uh, all I wanted to show you in this uh, short videos. It uh, may be continued. Okay, thanks for your attention. Bye bye.